today we're taking a look at approach and landing. Starting off with some tips about your aircraft speed. I've seen a lot of landings in flight gear where the plane is flying way too fast. For most airliners the touchdown speed is something around 140 knots depending on the plane, weight and wind. The speed for approach should be higher than that but generally not higher than 180 knots. When you start the approach the flaps should be fully up or almost fully up. If your plane has an auto brake feature it's always clever to activate it. It will do the wheel braking for you and on long runways you might not even need to apply thrust reverse. Going down the glide slope you should slowly slow down your plane to almost touchdown speed when you notice your plane's pitch has to be quite high to stay on the glide slope path you need to add more flaps but remember to watch your speed as you control the flaps when you're only a few hundred feet above the ground your speed should be about 10 knots above touchdown speed and your flaps should be fully or almost fully extended when you're getting close to your touchdown point decrease the engine power and gently pitch up your plane this is called the flare before touchdown. It needs a lot of practice to get this right, so don't be angry if it's not perfect the first time. As soon as your main gear is on the ground, you can extend the speed brakes. And if needed, apply thrust reverse and wheel brakes. Congratulations on landing successfully.